Yo, what up boys, it's Loser Boy here and today you're watching the Infinity Game Gauntlet and we're gonna be playing One Piece Bounty Rush. So, this is a game, well, no shit, it's a game based off One Piece, quite a popular anime, I think it's like top grossing, like four, 2 for 7. So yeah, we're gonna be playing it today. I have been playing this game for a while. But it's about time I give it a rating. And I will have to be brutally honest. So yeah, let's get into a match while I tell you guys what this game is. So this game is basically a 4v4 PvP. And I mean, it is kind of pay to win because you can just buy gems and then pull on characters. And if your luck is bad, you'll spend over 2000 dollars on buying stuff and if your luck is good you'll probably even get the character for free so it's a gacha game and the character you you are playing with does matter like right now the team you can see my team it's full of exes so these are like super rare characters even the enemy team is full of exes so at this point if you don't have an ex you're basically done for and that's just, that's the worst part about the game. It's it's not quite balanced. But Bandai is trying their best to balance the game out as much as they can. I was about to get destroyed. Oh my god. Oh, we both missed our skills. Damn, bro. See, I'm not the only shitty gamer out there, boys. Oh, damn. Okay, he's he's doing some damage. Oh, and he is currently using the latest EX out here, Shanks. So this game is pretty fun, but just super pay to win. Uh, even even the specs required to run the game aren't too high, so you can't be disappointed about that. Ooh, okay, okay. Ah, oh, shit, I missed my old skill. Shit. Okay, he's an anti-heal. Boom, we absolutely destroyed that Shanks right there. Um, as much as I like the game, it there's you're also at a disadvantage if you join the game late. Because everyone has more characters than you and you just get trashed on because they also level up faster than you. So, yes, it's it has its, it has its problems, but it also has its pros. So... I mean, it's it's worth playing. But yeah, for now, enjoy the gameplay and then I'll give you guys the rating. Alright, that was a good game. I, I'm pretty sure I got completely carried. Uh, but yeah, let's get to rating the game. Okay, so this is the second game we have tried and I think it's pretty good. It does have its cons, but it's good so far and the creator is actually trying to do something. But for now, I'm actually going to keep it at B. Uh, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye. And don't forget to subscribe, of course.